On March 24th of 1958, Elvis Presley entered the U.S. Army. He spent three days at Fort Chapel, Arkansas. But it wasn't long after that that Elvis Presley went overseas to Germany, where he was stationed there. Elvis then rented a house for his mother, father, and his grandmother, Minnie Mae. In an article called Express, it tells that Elvis's mother died months after Elvis was stationed in Germany. And it reads, Shortly after Gladys was diagnosed with hepatitis and her condition worsened very quickly, Elvis was given a moment to leave to visit her, arriving in Memphis on August 12th. But she died on August 14th of 1958 of heart failure at the age of 46 years old. Her death devastated Elvis and his father Vernon. Elvis and his father Vernon kept a broken piece of window pane, which Gladys had reportedly fallen into as a result of their deep grief. He never got over the passing of his mother, but as time went by, Elvis tried to keep it together. He had a party at his rented home in Germany where Carrie Grant introduced Priscilla to Elvis for the first time. Elvis looked at Priscilla, and she reminded him so much of his mother Gladys. Well, they did it all, but Priscilla was only 14 years old at that time. Listen to Elvis Presley's road band and close friend, Joe Espinito, what he had to say about 14-year-old Priscilla. Introduced him, and uh, uh, when she walked in the door, I mean, a very pretty young lady, but I didn't know how old she was at the time. And, uh, I figured she was about 16, but at the time she was 14, I find out later. Uh, but she was very mature, uh, very very quiet at first, because now she walked in the room with all these guys in there. And, uh, and then Elvis, you know, I mean, uh, that's a pretty tough uh, situation to be in.